I know you, boy. Marase. What a coincidence. Clear your schedule, because I'm going to take my time with you. Boys! Get this fucker back to the office! I really don't have time for this. You talk! Kaitasan! Stay the fuck out of this! Where are you? Come on! That was pretty sweet, man. Hey, you want to try helping out? Sure thing. My turn! You two fuckers are going down now! Please tell me you found something. You did, right? I think I did. 
Check out that camera. We're in the clear if the thing puts Hamra here at midnight. And if it doesn't? Let's... Let's try and stay optimistic. Well, camera. You got good news for us or what? This video shows everything you need to see. My client, Hamarasan, drunkenly attacked this passerby on the night of the murder. Then, after the altercation, that same passerby watched Hamarasan walk into Sana Goten. Nobody came out of the building after that, until the train started in the morning meaning the defendant was accounted for during the hours in question. The defense asserts that this video establishes a clear alibi, which can only be seen as proof of Hamarasan's innocence. To that end, I have a question for the prosecution. Did you have any prior knowledge of this video before the trial began? I assure you that we reviewed all the relevant footage from the sauna. And yet the defendant was nowhere to be found, Counsel. At least so I was told. Meaning, you never actually went to examine the site personally then. Would you say that's correct? Yes. My associates took care of that. Nonetheless, the defense's video is far too blurry to clearly identify either participant. There's no way to tell whether the man in the footage was the defendant or just a random pedestrian. <laughs> Thank you very much. In that case, the defense would like to call a witness to the stand. Seasan, do you claim you're the person in this video? That someone assaulted you that night? Is that accurate? Yes. It is. Now tell us, this person who assaulted you, are they here in the courtroom? Witness? Is there a problem? I, um... Hmm? I must have... been mistaken. I am the one getting hit in the video. But as to who the other guy was... Your Honor, a uh, recess, if you don't mind. What happened in there? I... I, I can't do it. I'm so sorry. But why? You were all ready to go this morning. I... got a phone call earlier. Go on. It said it was from my sister, but there was a strange man on the line. He said his name was... Marase. Told me you know him, Yagami-san. Marase? And he told you not to testify? Yes. He said if I did... If I did, I'd never see my sister again. Got it. What are you doing, Yagami? Calling the police? Kaito-san, it's me. Those KJ art guys took Seiya's sister. I'm heading over there now. Could use a hand. The hell are you doing? We're in the middle of a trial here. A trial doesn't mean shit if you can't protect your witness. Uh... 
Buy me as much time as you can. I'll get Seiya's sister back. I'm the one who dragged you into this. I'll be the one to drag you out. Promise. By time, he says. He knows this is a court, right? <laughs>